Hello Internet, and welcome back to An Author Plays Pokemon Insurgents, playing version 116. I fixed all the mistakes from last time. Uh, we've saved multiple times, we got everybody about to the same level that we were initially, and this time what I did was off-screen, I went ahead and got ourselves this lovely little Magnemite. And that's because this person, uh, right next to us, who they actually kind of looked like we were holding hands, um, but anyways, wanted any Steel type for his Delta Scyther. So, we're going to trade him our trader, and see what happens. I'm, I have no idea what this uh, this Delta Scyther looks like, or what its typing is, or its usefulness, what level it'll be, I, I don't know. But we'll find out. So, sit back and watch the trade, I guess. Oh. Ooh, that's pretty. Um, that was a very, was a very weak trade. Like, in the games, you, you see all the, you know, the, the Pokeballs whooshing past one another, and I don't know. Ice and fighting. Interesting. Hustle boosts the attack stat below its accuracy. Sure. Oop, there we go. Huh. Ice and fighting. Can Scyther even learn an ice move normally? Like, I don't think it, it can learn ice punch or anything like that. So I wonder if its move set has been been altered in some way? I don't know. That's interesting. Well, that's definitely a team member we're going to have to boost. Um, probably in between episodes. And uh, get up to par with everybody else on the team. Because right now, level 17 isn't going to do us very much. Um, as you probably saw on the splash screen just a moment ago, I've got everybody to about 23, 24, uh, maybe a couple on the higher end of 25. That is not something we can deal with. Um, send in Renee. But anyways, um, yeah, we've got everybody in the, the mid-20s, the mid we'll say, except for Delta Grimer, who's obviously a little bit ahead of the curve. But we'll uh, we'll get everybody there. So get a bit of a future sight on. Spark is going to do some damage, including the paralysis. That's unfortunate. Oh man, my eyes been bugging me. It's been kind of a, it's been kind of like a groggy day for me today. Um. Oh, confused. I didn't even see that. Nice. Um, it's been raining all day, as it does in the Sunshine State during the summer, and I woke up with a massive headache, and it, it's it's really taken the last like hour or so, and I'm now recording at like three in the afternoon. It's taken, like, the last hour for it to actually sort of come down a little bit. And it's just, uh, it's no bueno. But, I wanted to play this. I finally got everybody back to where we were supposed to be last night, so... I just... Ooh, that's probably one hit. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's keep Patty alive, shall we? Um... Please don't have Pursuit? Okay. <laughs> so yeah, it's been kind of a groggy today. A groggy day, rather. It's easy for me to say. Um, I'm just kind of hoping that that doesn't come through too much in the recording. Because I'm having fun, and I, I enjoy doing this. It's just... For the last, like, two hours, I was like, I need to record. I'm behind. Ugh. <laughs> rollout! Did we miss with one of the rollouts? Okay. Marty's going to go down. Or maybe not. Jeez. Wow. I am surprised. Pikachu leveled. Croconaw. I mean, really all I can do is send in Katie. Katie's the only one that's got full hit points and she'll have the sleep. Oh, man. I forgot how tough this guy was. I did everything except for fight this dude. And... I, I just... I was not ready, I guess. That's really the best way to put it. Come on, let's get the stat boosts. Or not. Oh, you're awake already! Go back to sleep. Just chill out. Nobody, nobody needs what you're bringing. Nobody wants it. Nobody cares for it. Ah, uh, you're putting stuff in my eye with the silver wind, Katie. Oh, there we go. Okay, and then a confusion to finish him off. Now that's what sleep should look like. Multiple turns. <laughs> Thank you. Aw, oh, and so close to level two. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Uh, I don't want to go too far ahead because there might be more trainers or a cutscene. I do see an item over here, though. It's a free Pokeball. Cool. That'll replace the one we caught the Magnemite with. Uh, 
uh, yeah, okay. So, I think what I'll do is surf over here because I see an item. There we go. Pick that up. Nice. Revive, even. Okay, so I'm gonna go get everybody healed, and then we'll be right back. So, sit tight. Okay, and we're back. Uh, I wanted to cut in, even though we're still on the way back to the, to the next route, because I just looked up Delta Scyther while we were getting our... Uh, our Pokémon healed up. There we go. That's the word I wanted. And it turns out that the uh, developers of this game were very smart in that they swapped up Scyther's moveset to incorporate his type changes. And I'm sure they did that for everybody else as well, because they obviously did it with Grimer. But I just wasn't sure what to expect. So it turns out that he's going to get some pretty bitchin' moves, and we'll see those as, uh, as Cleaver here starts growing in power. But in the meantime, there's some good stuff happening here. For, for good old Delta Scyther, so I'm, I'm thinking Delta Scyther is going to be a permanent part of the team, but we'll find out. Uh, I'm leading with him right now, so that way, hopefully, uh, we can fight random Pokemon. No, uh, so that way when we get into a battle, such as this one, uh, I can swap him out for somebody else and do kind of like what I'm sure a lot of people have done for underlevel Pokemon or, or Magikarps in the past. I know that was a big one for me growing up was getting the stupid level 5 Magikarp before Mount Moon. You know, like, oh, am I going to get this thing to level freaking 20 when it doesn't learn an offensive move for 10 more levels? Ow. That's not going to do a whole lot. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, have some Gust. Oh, and Butterfree leveled up while we were gone as well. Uh, just fought a random Ralts to, to uh, top off the tank, as it were. And, um... Learn Psybeam, so nice. I've been studying the new fairy type. The one thing I don't understand is our dragon immunity. How does that work? And then a battle. Okay, cool. Um, it works because the competitive scene demanded it. The den. Well, could definitely not leave Cleaver in against that. So we'll send in Pigpen. Because Pigpen's going to eat half of your moves, the den. Okay. Uh, we'll have to use the mud bomb then. Because we've had our attacks severely limited. Mud bomb. Dang. I was hoping... F I mean, I knew it was going to be a bit much to ask for the one-hit KO, but a man can dream, right? A man can dream. So I actually don't remember what level Grimer evolves. I think it's like 33 or 37. Pigpen should be pretty close to... to leveling. And Scyther leveled. Uh, yeah, we'll swap... We'll switch in Cleaver for the XP gain, and then we'll switch into... Oh. Who are we going to switch into? I don't know. Um, because we don't have a fighting move on Cleaver yet. I don't like doing it, but no, Marty won't do us any good either. Magnemite has Levitate, so we can't do ground, which means we'd need fighting or fire, and we don't have any of that. Um... We'll try Renee, and I guess we'll try to inflict confusion. We've got the future sight as well, which will do quite a bit. Magnet bomb shouldn't do much. Or I'm lying. That works too. There we go. And then maybe get some confusion on. It's not very effective. Okay, yeah, we'll switch into pig pen here, and I'm Thinking the future site will finish? I'm hoping. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Cleaver leveling up. Renee getting stuff. Clink. Um, yeah, we gotta switch to Cleaver. Get some XP on him. Because he's young, he's, he's green, he's fresh. I really like that model, too. I, it reminds me of something, and I can't remember what. Like, I've seen something designed like that before. <sighs> I know. For any of you out there that play tabletops, like tabletop RPGs, he reminds me of the artwork for the Ice Elemental... Um, oh, what are they called? They're not Archons. Whoa, what's going on there? Okay, that happened. Um, God. In 4th edition D&D, there's a book for the Forgotten Realms that lets you play the Forgotten Realms for your party. And there's a race in there that's basically a race of elementals. And I can't remember the name of the race off the top of my head. It's 
It's right there on the tip of my tongue. It's not... It's not Archon. Ah, oh, man. I can't remember. Oh, that's gonna bother me the whole time now. Dang it. That's gonna bug me. Either way, that's what it reminds me of. It reminds me of, like, an Ice Elemental Warrior. Of some degree. And I'm sure that's the effect that they were going for. But even still, just... Man, I can't remember that name that's bugging me. <laughs> oh, man. If I, rem if I remember when I'm editing this, I'll uh, I'll throw up a link, or not a link, I'll throw up a, a picture somewhere around now. So that's what it reminds me of, down down there. And in the meantime, I'm going to get some stuff off on this gloom. Paralyzed. Yay! I love paralysis. Oh my god, twice in a row. Come on, what kind of RNG can I have here? The worst is the answer, by the way. The worst kind. Cleaver, growing to level 20. Blossom. Yep, gotta... Gotta keep doing what we're doing with Cleaver. There we go. Now, at least, at least in my mind, and I don't remember if this is the case or not, but Blossom seems like one of those Pokemon that should have been essentially retconned into a fairy type. Um, I don't know if that's actually the case or not off the top of my head, but at least at least if you believe in fairies being adorable and cutesy and, and sort of manipulative with their moveset, I feel Blossom fits that. It's essentially 100%, at least my mind. I'm not a designer. I don't know what, what the uh, intentions were, I guess you could say, with the sort of retconning types. Cleaver's trying to learn low sweep. Yes, we will get rid of a move for that. Reduces the target's speed. Um, yeah, we'll keep the agility, I guess, and get rid of focus energy. All right, now we have a stab move on him, finally. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. So, is this city or another area? Mechie Town. Cool. Okay. Well, we'll heal up, and then I guess we'll... Was those, were those Yoshi eggs? Those are Yoshi eggs. Okay, we gotta heal up fast so I can see what that is. These people are mixing the games here. Mixing Nintendo IPs. There we go. Okay, we need to see what's going on over here. I'm very intrigued by this. What do you have to say? Uh, the small town feel of this place really appeals to me over Helios. The sound of birds chirping, the river's roaring. I absolutely love it here. I'm glad for you. I heard that the legendary Kami Tree are hidden somewhere in the region. Isn't that incredible? Here in the Torin region. Cool. I want to go explore these houses, but I also want to see why there are Yoshi eggs here. So let's go do that. Oh, hey, how did you beat me here? Yeah, I know it's you, Nora. I see you finally made it to Mechi Town. I love this place. I used to live here, actually. I just wanted to meet up and talk about something. But first, how about we battle? Oh, uh, Ah, man, I'm not ready for this fight. I'm not ready for this fight. Hone Edge. <laughs> I am definitely not ready for this fight. Shoot. Oh, man. This is going to end poorly. This is going to end very, very poorly. Uh, Mud Bomb. Retaliate shouldn't do a whole lot. Bam! Okay. Man. I really gotta get into the habit of saving more. Floet. Just fairy type? I think... I actually don't remember what fairies are weak against. I'll be right back. I'm so bad at type matchups. Okay, I'm back. So apparently it's poison and steel and I don't have Nido King. So the answer to Floet is just going to have to be... a lot of damage. So we're gonna send in Marty. Even though it has some grass moves, I'm hoping that a I'm hoping that a huge power Aqua Tail will get it one hit or not. Okay, well, your wish is gonna be wasted, so sorry about that. Alright, good job, Marty. He's trying to learn play rough. Yes! We will get rid of a move for play rough. Get rid of stupid defense curl, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Dragon's gonna suck it now. Jeez, keep going, why don't you? Golbat, we have Pikachu who will probably get wrecked, but we have to try it. 
Man, I'm thinking Pikachu's next on the chopping block for the for the old team here. So I really don't know what else to do. Thundershock. Oh, and we got the paralysis. So does Electro Ball do more now? Yes, it does. <laughs> Take it. Oh. Kids, don't open your mouth. Don't count your chickens before they hatch. Dang it. Uh, we'll send in Renee to get in with a quick attack, I guess. Boop. Oh, come on! Don't poison. Thank you. Go down! Thank you. Oh, uh, boy. Well, we got a level, so that's nice. Swadloon. Bugging grass, right? So we send in Katie. Oh, man. Eye is bugging me. I feel like I've had sinus pressure on this side of my face the whole day. And it refuses to go away, and I'm getting real sick of it. Man, that defense. Bug bite's not going to do anything, bub. There we go. Sit down, swaddle. Okay. Send in Celebi. <laughs> okay. Um... Gust, I guess. Ow. 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 Um, Marty. <laughs> oh, this is a grass type. This was stupid. Yeah, this was very stupid. Goodbye. <laughs> Freaking crits, man. Ugh. Crits are my bane. Man, I don't know what to do here. Bite? Safeguard shouldn't do very much. It does nothing. Come on, flinch! Dang. No! Don't! Damn it! Mmm. We're gonna have to revive somebody. Where's the revive? There it is. <sighs> um... With that ancient power, we don't really have anybody. We'll revive... we'll revive Marty. Man. We'll send in, we gotta get a healing... we gotta get healing off on Marty. That's really all there is to it. Ah, this blows! There we go. And then, one hit. Pretty close. Pursuit's probably, yeah, way too slow. Dang it. Okay, please no crits this time. Please no crits. This play rough should do it. Come on. Ah, damn. Even with the crit. God damn it. Man, I wish I could get some indication as to when I'm gonna fight somebody big like that. Because I have no way of freaking knowing. And that uh, just pisses me off. Uh, Alright. Well, we'll spend some of the money. Thankfully, we didn't seem to lose very much. So that's, that's nice. Uh, yeah, I could use an escape rope right now. Escape rope from my life. Okay, well, I guess we'll explore some of the houses, and then... This is gonna be a short episode, but I don't really want to just do grinding. Just... It's it's boring to watch, it really, it just, that's just really all there is to it. Uh, I was a kid that saves the world from the teams, I would understand if that was one or two fluke victories, but that can't be a coincidence. <laughs> I just love spending time with my Pokémon. My Luxray and I have had so many great moments together. That's cute. I'd like to give you a gift. Char- Okay, thanks! 
I move of a chance to make your Pokemon stronger when using it. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. <laughs> Sup, Cubal? Okay, cool. What about you? What do you have to say? I heard that the... Oh, I spoke to you already. Whoops. Ah. <sighs> All because I had the audacity to see what's up with the Yoshi eggs. How dare I? I can mean that there's more water down below. I wonder how deep it goes. Hint, use dive. Do you know Nora? Yes, I do. She's a bitch. She's actually my sister. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, your sister's a bitch and challenges people with legendary Pokemon. Meh. Would you like to buy this egg off of me? I found it on a journey and hardly need it. I'll give it to you for 3,000. Did I... Did I get it? I don't know if I got it or not. Find that egg helpful, young one. Okay. Is it... Where... Where is it? Is it in my box, maybe? I don't know. All right, let's go see if it's in our box. Nope, oh, there we go. Do, 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 do. All right, PC. Yeah, there it is. Okay. All right. Sorry, Pikachu, but we, um, we're downsizing. It's really the best way to put it. We're downsizing. Okay, so I think there's one more house we can take a look at. I think. Should be. Maybe. There's another dude we can talk to. I saw some young girl running into town earlier. I could hear her clomping across the bridge from inside my house. Nice. Okay, well, that's pretty much all there is for us to do until we grind everybody up till about level 27. So, I'm gonna save here. And that's it for the episode. Sorry it's a short one, but I don't want to... I don't want to do all that grinding on episode. It's just, it's just boring. So when we pick up, we'll be in battle with Nora. And if you want to see that, then go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I've got Pokemon Insurgents along with more fun stuff on its way. Uh, go ahead and leave this video a like if you enjoyed yourselves. Pen me a comment down below. I'd love to see those. And I hope to catch you in the next chapter. Bye-bye. Excellent child. Did you just slap him? <laughs> that was such a weird slap animation. What's wrong with you? That's absolutely dis... What was that? That, my dear girl, is the reason we wanted the run. Just because I mocked Orion doesn't mean I don't know what it truly is. Is it a Delta?